Detroit's police chief sounding off today about assault weapons, illegal guns, and repeat offenders. Chief White calling on lawmakers and the courts to do something. Fox News' Amy Lang continuing our team coverage. She joins us live with more. Amy? Well, Ruth and Taryn, as you heard from Jessica, the chief today calling Officer Courts and his partner Heroes, outlining just what happened last night, but also taking aim at the bigger picture, guns. This is unacceptable, and this should be the line. Whatever your tipping point is, this should be it. Detroit Police Chief James White demanding action after the devastating loss of one of their own, Officer Lauren Courts, ambushed by a 19-year-old man armed with a semi-automatic Draco pistol. The suspected gunman walked out of the building with this weapon in his hand. This is a 7.62 semi-automatic Draco uh, uh, pistol. It is similar uh, in caliber to an AK-47 and has a banana clip as well. This type of weapon is designed to fire multiple rounds in very quick succession. These assault weapons are ridiculous in our communities and they're causing death, period. The chief says assault weapons like this don't belong in the community. This is a cut down version of an AK rifle. And I refer to them as image firearms. People buy them because of the image associated with them. Do you need a gun that shoots 30 rounds? No, you don't. Bill Kusick is a former police officer and the owner of Action Impact Firearms in Southfield. Anybody that cares about law enforcement should be hurting today. I hope they are. All these guns are dangerous, and this one's dangerous, and they're in the wrong hands. It's 100% legal, and it's going to continue to be legal. Chief White lamenting the easy availability and accessibility of high-powered weapons in a country reeling from mass shootings. Tops Friendly Market in Buffalo, New York, Robb Elementary School in Uvalde, Texas, the 4th of July parade in Highland Park, Illinois, and here, the murder of a police officer with another high-powered weapon purchased within the last two weeks. In light of everything that's going on in this country, an assault rifle that was recently purchased, counterintuitive that we would be selling assault rifles at this time. We can't even slow that down. The chief also calling on the courts to help, asking judges to increase bonds to keep dangerous criminals locked up. And we need help. We lock them up, keep them locked up. If you violate the law, there needs to be a penalty for it. I don't see anybody fearing a penalty for it. How many times did we stumble onto someone who should have been incarcerated that's out on the street committing another act? And we need, says Chief White, illegal guns off the streets. Driving crime in our communities, and, and we all have to care. We all have to care. This is all of our problem. You know, the chief saying clearly this is not just a Detroit problem, but a countrywide problem, calling on the city and suburbs to work together to take action to get these guns out of the wrong hands. Amy, thank you.